Hello, wonderful art students. Uh, I'm going to walk you through how to do this one, this assignment, draw two faces talking using Google Draw. And the, the point here is to use the curve tool as much as possible. If you don't use it, the grade's not going to be very high. Um, so do it. Uh, give it a try. Give your, your best. Um, give it your all. And so I'm going to go on and I'm going to, this, if you were to go and create um, your, to get to the Google drawing um, area, this is not my assignment, but I'm going to use it as an example. So I already made one here. There's your work. You add or create, pull down, do drawings, but I already did that. So I'm just going to go straight to it. And <clears throat> here I have two circles that I made. Um, I use the circle tool, shapes and went circles and then i click and dragged it across but i already have those circles so i'm going to um <clears throat> move on to this that's just giving you an idea of how to get to this place now i'm going to go to my actual file which i already made the angry face today i'm going to go ahead and make them sad face using the curve tool so this is just really how to use the curve tool um so i'm going to select it curve and then I'm going to go click, click, click. And I'm making this shape that I can fill in with, um, with a color. So I'm going to make this black. Actually, I kind of like it. I'm going to go yellow. How about that? Uh, and then I'm going to copy, copy, and right click and paste. <clears throat> then I'm going to drag this over here, and then I'm going to go, go to Arrange and Rotate and Flip Horizontally. So now that will be my other eyebrow, which I didn't even have to draw. Isn't that great? Um, so you got that, and then I'm going to go back to my Curve tool, and I'm going to make these little sad, oh, undo, sad, sad eyes. Whoops, and I didn't get it. Uh, it's kind of, it is a little frustrating to use this tool, but once you get it, um, it's really nice to be able to make whatever shape you want to and then fill it in easily. So I'm gonna go make this mm, kind of pinkish. How's that? Nah, that's gross. Um, there, then I'm gonna go, I'm not gonna have too much more time to do this video, so I'm gonna go, copy and paste and then i'm going to flip it again go to arrange go to rotate go to flip horizontally and there we go we got another one and i'm going to make a little sad mouse mouth mouse mouth click 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 and keep clicking and moving clicking and moving until i get back to the start okay and then I can do the same thing. I can change this to black. And then I could also check this out. I'm going to copy, copy from the there. And I'm going to paste and use this teeth shape over here. And I think I can manipulate it. Good enough. These do not have to be fabulous, amazing, uh, realistic works. So I'm just going to leave that there, and then I'm going to use my scribble and put in some teeth. Looks kind of funny, but that's fine. And then I just need some tears, because it's sad. I need some tears. Uh, I'm going to go back to my curve, and I'm going to go click and click and click and click. And there's one. And I, I'll make another one here. And then I'm going to fill that one there and fill this one here, there. Now I can just copy and paste, copy and paste. And you get that? I'm going to lose my, I'm going to, my, uh, I can only do a five minute video. So, which is fine with you, I'm sure. Don't forget, align, arrange arrange flip horizontally and then you got this there there we go i used the curve tool to make a sad and angry face and that's all you got to do